Good morning, my name is Erin. I am the mom to five. I'm coming to you with a brand new video. So just to kind of get this in perspective of what, where we're going with this, this is this week. So this is Monday, um, June 22nd. <clears throat> I had actually filmed the beginning of the first week of July. And um, if you, I, I haven't ever said, but I'm actually in a different location in my home because the, my normal office is in a shambles. And because it's in the shambles, um, <clears throat> that's also where our internet modem is. And my roommate accidentally tripped over the cord and knocked the internet out. So I was like, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna be able to upload any videos. Well, what I decided was the other yesterday, um, I'm sorry, Saturday, I decided that I was gonna go ahead and do a basically after the pin of my health planner. And Jen just fill everything in throughout that week. And I was like, well, that's not gonna work after I filmed it because I need something to go up next Monday. Well, so what I decided was I'll go ahead and show this week. Yes, the stickers have already been placed down. Everything is already where it's supposed to be. But what I can do is just kind of walk you through what I did. I've had so many questions about this specific planner out of all my three planners, this specific planner. I've had the most questions um, and it, I'm excited about that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you through my process. It is early in the morning, Monday morning. Um, I have written down on a piece of paper how many hours sleep I have because I do use my phone um, to film. Um, and that's where all of my stuff is. So what I wrote everything down and I'm gonna go ahead and put it in. I also hadn't updated my monthly. And if you remember back to the very first video, um, and if you didn't see that video, the what I use my monthly for is to track my mood, my overall mood for the day. And if I did or didn't have anxiety. So I went ahead and pulled my character stickers. I'm using um, the cleaning script from Penny. Um, Penny is my favorite character sticker. I use Penny, Little Dill, um, Waddles, and Petey from, Little Dill is from Beyond Paper Flowers. Um, Petey is from, Petey and Waddles is from Crack Penguin Planner. And then um, I have this, and this is from Pretty Cute Planner and it's Everyday Pugs. I love this sticker sheet. I actually am going to be ordering more because I love this sticker sheet. And then this is what's left over from the two sheet kit, two sheet kit that I use from Craft Penguin Planner. So if I need anything, so you will be seeing this this week. So, um, but this is to mark what I, I did an update Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. So I'm going to do that with you. And then I'll take you into today. I'll put my weight in um, which I took this morning in my sleep. And what I'm going to do is every morning when I update this planner, because it's so easy for me to do it anyway, um, I'm going to just film it as I put everything in. So let's get started. First of all, again, this is a weeks, Avalon and Ninth weeks coil planner. She has seven different, um, covers. It only comes in black coil um, and it is undated. So you can start it whenever you feel like. Um, I do have tabs in mind. My tabs are from um, Beyond Paper Flowers. Um, she is also linked down the below. Um, I have a charm in here just so that I know where my place is. Um, so let's get started. So this is what I do every Monday. Now, um, if you didn't see my first video, my quick flip through, um, this is where I keep my school ID for me to get into the gym. Um, this is my, the workout videos I do. This is where I keep my weight tracker. Now, I do track my weight in the original weeks, um, in the actual day, um, the week that I'm doing in, but I keep everything on here. So, last week on 6.15, I weighed 197.4. This morning when I weighed, I weighed 195.7. So I actually lost a pound, one pound and seven ounces, which is great. I don't know what I did because I eat about the same. 
I, I think I do know what happened. Um, I noticed my weight has started climbing back up when I started my workout app because I started, if you look on here, I started my working out on the first, like a really, and it, my just weight just kept shooting up. And I think it was muscle building. Well, I didn't really do a lot of workout this past week because we have had a leak in our office and we've had somebody here and I have to go to work and stuff. So I haven't been able to work out because he's here. And by the time I get home in the afternoon, it's, um, it's time for me to cook dinner. So I'm gonna go ahead and, um, get zoomed in here. So I didn't lay down what my moods were for these three days. I did look, I kind of sometimes put something in my planner. So on Friday, I was in a happy mood. It was my roommate's birthday. So we went out to eat um, after I got off work. I'm gonna use my tweezers here. My tweezers are from Perfect Prints Co. I do believe they're in stock. I'm not 100% sure. I will link her below. I didn't experience any anxiety that day, so I'm not going to put it there. On Saturday, I did nothing. I had a great day. I, I actually probably drank eight, nine cups of coffee that day. Um, wouldn't be a surprise if I had been <laughs> like that. I But um, I think I'm going to I kind of want to use this one because I drank so much coffee, but I kind of want to use that one because that's really I, what I did all day. I think I'm going to use the coffee one because I just, it looks so cute. So that's that one. And so yesterday, which was Sunday, the 21st, Father's Day, I cleaned the entire day. And when you're having any kind of construction going on in your house, I don't care how clean it is. It's, it's terrible. The dust is everywhere, but I cleaned and her face, I don't know if you can see her face. That's exactly what my face looked like yesterday. I was not pleased. I said, can't y'all keep your dust in one spot? I just want my office back. Um, it's been down for a week and it is driving me crazy. I'm not going to put my feelings. I think it's self-explanatory where things, I was lazy those days. And so here we are, I started a new week. I'm excited. Let's think, hope things are doing much better. Okay, so here is my kit. Let me go ahead and pull you out here. So here is my kit. This again is by um, Craft Penguin Planner. Um, I, I'm not real sure what the name of the kit is, um, and so, but I let me look it up for you, and then I can go from there. I apologize, internet's down, so I'm having to use another computer to get that information. But while that's coming up. Uh, I track my workout and my walk. I do go on a daily walk every day. I do work out every day, usually. Um, I, I hope I get to work out this week. Um, as of right now, he's not here, but that doesn't mean he's not gonna show up in five minutes. So I, I don't like to work out when other people are here. Um, for my own personal reasons, I, I, I don't, it's not make, make, I'm not comfortable doing that. And then I have work today as well. Let me see, I am so sorry. I probably should have had this pulled up already. Um, so um, I track my sleep, I track my move goal. Um, my move goal this week has, um, it's Dandelion Wishes is the name of this kit. So there we go. This is, I actually used the same kit in my A6 rings this week. Um, I love this kit, I love, Jennifer over at Craft Penguin Planner. She's, I, I buy a lot of stuff from her shop. Um, you will see her a lot. I know these are the first couple of videos y'all are seeing. Um, you will see her a lot. For one, I only buy my scripts from her. Um, I get a lot of my character characters from her and I also get a lot of my kits. The kit that I'm using for my birthday this year is not a typical birthday kit. Um, it actually, out of I've been planning with stickers for over a year. Um, 
and out of every sticker kit that I've ever gotten, it is my favorite. And I actually have two of them. So, but anyway, let's back to here. Um, I went ahead, she only had, this is meant for PP weeks. Um, this has a place for two washies. I didn't put anything, maybe something will come up at the end of the week or whatever. I'll put that there. Um, here's Monday. Let's go here. So my move goal usually is 500. It is changed to 550. And that was a suggestion on my watch. So all week will be 550. Um, and that's probably because I'm more active <clears throat> than normal, I guess. I don't know what normal would have been, but it will not change. So I'm going to go ahead and write that in. Let me make sure I'm in frame here. I'm going to go ahead and pull y'all in. I hope to be getting a new desk so soon. Um, this desk is very old and it is very worn. I do use it a lot and um, with cleaner, so I, and I'm always cleaning it. So anyway, let's go. Uh, so this little sticker right here is off, also by Craft Penguin Planner. It is a foldable. I just used a foldable, this one, because um, I can put what my current weight is, but I can also put that I lost weight or I gained weight. I, I don't really care that it's being covered. I just have it there because it has the, I have the ability to do that. So like I said, I have my, um, my numbers here. So my move goal changed. My weight is 195.7. I lost, um, 1.7 pounds. Very good. Very good, Aaron. Very good. Proud of yourself. Last night, I slept eight hours and 10 minutes. So what I am going to do, I went ahead and did my weigh-in. This is where I'm going to put my pace. What my pace when I walked um, is this afternoon. I do get off at five o'clock today. Um, I'll put my pace right here. Um, and I like to know if I, my pace increased or decreased. <clears throat> A lot of times it does determine you know, by how much my leg is bothering me that day. Um, I'm going to try to get my work in to work out in today. I only have, I have 30 minutes today. That is my goal. Um, we'll see. I'm hoping. And here is my cake house. So far, all I've had this morning is a coffee and a banana. So hopefully I can stay within my range. I try not to eat more than 1200 calories a day. Um, but let's see if we can get my work and work out in my walk-in today. And I will um, update this tomorrow morning. I will put in my steps for today, um, how many K cows that I had for today, what my overall move goal it was, what my pace was, and we'll see if I get to check off any of these two. And we'll see how I did on my hydrate. So see you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. Welcome back. This is day two which is day three. I lied. I said I'd be back the next morning. It's actually two days later. <clears throat> Long story short, yesterday, um, I didn't get much sleep. And or the night before, I didn't get much sleep. And um, I had to go to work yesterday. And it just really wasn't a good day. <clears throat> I was really tired. I tried to sleep as much as I could because I was going to be working late last night. Anyway, here we are, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to update you on Monday and yesterday. Um, also, my internet's back up, so hopefully I'll get to film a plan with me today that will go up hopefully tomorrow, which is Thursday, um, in my A6 rings, and yeah, that's it. So let's get started on this one. So I'm gonna go, let's go and update my monthly view. So on Monday, I found this little sticker sheet and this is from Pretty Cute Planner. I love, she has the pug one and this one. I love them. But Monday, I was just kind of in my place. I was in the zone. So we are going to go ahead and place, let me go ahead and zoom you in so you can see what I'm doing. I'm gonna go ahead and place that very cute love it happy to report no anxiety that day yesterday i just felt like yoda i i, I did oh uh, 
the force with with me. That's all I gotta say. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. And no anxiety. So that's great. So let's go to this daily. I had a clip in here and I took it out. Now here we are. So as I said, I have not been back in my book since Monday where I, y'all watched me put that I had slept for eight hours and 10 minutes. I marked my weight. That's it. I did not walk on Monday because it's been storming. Yesterday it did not walk, it's been stormy. I did not do my workout because the guy was here on Monday. So I was not able to do my workout and then I had work in the same thing yesterday. They're supposed to be here later today, but I'm off today. So maybe I'll get some work in, workout. So I'm gonna go ahead and let's update my steps. On Monday, I had 8,066 steps. And yesterday I had 17,924 steps. I'll be honest with you, my back is hurting this morning and I'm sure that's because I walked so much. So on Monday, I my move was 529, which I did not hit my move goal. And a lot of that was due to the fact that that is terrible handwriting. 529, um, I, I was sitting a lot at a, in a chair at work, so I didn't get a lot of movement in. Um, and I ate 1,176 calories. So my goal, I don't want to go over 1,200 calories a day. And so I'm under that. Now, when I come back, when I go to my new section, I'm no longer going to be putting steps over here. I'm going to put steps here because my schedule at work is increasing and I'm not going to be able to walk in the afternoon. And to be honest with you, I never sit down usually at work. So I'll be able to get, my goal is to have more than 10,000 steps a day, and which is why I've been walking. But I do a lot of walking, running at work. So I'm going to use this as my step counter. Um, my workout, even though I didn't work out like with a workout, thing I did get seven hours or yeah seven minutes of 30 minutes that's not hours that would be terrible seven hours of working out so um here we go yesterday the night before on Tuesday night I got six hours and 50 minutes I require a lot more sleep than that um my move goal yesterday was 906 so I knocked my move goal out of a of park it was 550. Um, my cacao yesterday I didn't eat a lot, only ate 983 calories. That's not very much, usually, I'm much higher than that. Um, my cardio, um, out of 30 minutes or my exercise out of 30 minutes yesterday was nine, and like I said, my steps. So, and then last night. I slept for eight hours and 15 minutes. So I will see y'all again tomorrow morning. Let me go ahead and pull this out. So there we go. Um, I will go ahead and up y'all tomorrow. Hopefully I'm able to get some workout in today's. I do not work today or tomorrow. So Hopefully I can at least get a walk. I'm not sure I'll be able to walk because we are supposed to have terrible weather again today and tomorrow and Friday and Saturday and Sunday. It's supposed to be very, very bad here. And it has been very bad here. Um, so in fact, yesterday it was raining so hard at work. We could not hear, I was talking to a coworker and we could, I couldn't hear my coworker talking because the rain on the roof was so loud. So it was very strange. Um, oh, I need to do, I do this one thing. Um, before I get off here, I'm going to go ahead and update this. I know I hit my goal, um, of 96 cal, um, hydro, um, ounces in my water yesterday and Monday because, um, that's something I really, I have to make sure that I drink enough water every day and that's more, oh, I didn't even do that in there, but here's what I did. Um, 
So I know I hit Monday and I hit Tuesday, I hit my water goal. So, um, but anyway, that's that. Um, let's go ahead and play it out. But I will see y'all again tomorrow morning. Bye guys. Good morning. Welcome back. Today is Thursday. So I said yesterday I'd be back today. Look, I'm here, I'm back. Yesterday, I hurt so bad. I, I'm not really even real sure why I was hurting like I was. And um, my back hurt and my legs are hurting. My knee was hurting really, really bad. So, let's see. But I was also extremely tired. So, when I mark my feelings for yesterday, I'm gonna use a penny done with today sticker because I was really done with the day yesterday. I was ready to go back to bed as soon as I got up. So, and then today I got a text message uh, very early this morning that they changed my schedule at work. So I will not have the day off like I was initially told. So I also didn't do hardly anything yesterday. Speaking of work or nothing, I didn't do a lot yesterday. So I know I drank, I drank a lot of water. I did drink all 96 ounces of water. I slept eight hours and 15 minutes. Here's what I'm doing, I'm sorry. I, I should say this, let's go ahead and fill in today. Let's do my steps real quick. Um, I did 4,049 steps. Like I said, um, when I was filming yesterday, um, next week, uh, um, when I start doing the new layouts, when I start using the Avalon and Ninth um, monthly functional subscription, I do this. I'm I'm gonna put something different in this. I'm gonna use this as my goals um, instead of using this for steps because, like I said, I'm not walking as much because I am getting so many steps in at work. So, what was my move goal yesterday? 372. Um, and my exercise yesterday, at least I got something. I got three minutes. <laughs> That's so bad. And my cake house, that was what I was missing. I didn't eat a lot yesterday. My cake house yesterday was 775. In fact, um, my fitness pal would not let me close out. Um, I'm gonna put bad weather here because we're not. I'm not able to w walk anyway right, right now because we are getting so much bad weather. In fact, you may be able to hear thunder in, in a minute because it's been thundering pretty loudly. But um, in fact, my um, sorry, squirrel. My my fitness pal would not let me in the day. Um, I did not. Let me get this back in here. I didn't walk and I didn't work out. And I know I'm not working out today. Um, we have we are getting my office put back together. Hopefully, they're supposed to be here today to put the floor down, and we'll see. So I went ahead and got my sleep this morning. I only slept five hours last night. I was hurting so bad. Um, and so let's hope that I can do better. Obviously I'm working nine hours today, so things will get better. My move goals <laughs> will be better than yesterday. So just to recap where we're at, I got eight hours and 15 minutes of sleep last night or on Wednesday night. I had my move goal was only 372 of 550, which is terrible. I only ate 775 calories. Um, really didn't walk because of the bad weather. I didn't work out. was hurting really bad. I have to know my limitations. I had 4,049 steps. I didn't work out or walk yesterday. So, that being that, let's tomorrow or today when I turn on in the morning, Let's hope that we can put a lot better statistics here or stats here. Um, 
So I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. It's Monday the 29th. I actually thought I was recording a minute ago and I wasn't. I'm going to go back what I did real quick. So I last left off with you um, on Thursday morning. I, I didn't know what Thursday was going to be like. So I did Thursday with side eye. It was just kind of like a let's get this day over with kind of thing. Friday was in a very good mood. I was happy. Um, no anxiety. Um, Saturday and Sunday, to be honest with you, I was just really tired. Yesterday, I was so, so tired. So I, but the good thing is that the last week, the last two weeks, I haven't had any anxiety at all. So that's a really good thing. Um, like I said, I thought I was filming. I'm going to go ahead and pull you in a little bit. Um, just to backtrack of what happened, I did not walk or work out this week. I didn't walk this week largely because it was very bad weather all week. And I didn't work out because of my work schedule and some construction going on here. Um, the last time I checked in was um, Thursday morning. I had my Wednesday count. My Thursday steps were 19,572. Friday was 17,998. Saturday was... 15,441 and then Sunday, which was yesterday, was 15,112. So <clears throat> on Thursday, which was the last time I, I only got five hours of sleep, but I got all of my water that day. My move was 971 with my KCAL intake is 573. Now I haven't been eating a lot um, because of my work schedule. I am eating, I'm eating generally a Subway sandwich or a sub from Firehouse Subs and that's what I've been eating. That will kind of change. I didn't walk Thursday, Friday, Thursday and Friday I didn't walk because the weather was very bad and I didn't get home in time in the afternoon. I don't get home until late in the evening. Um, but during the day, the weather was really bad. So we had bad weather. I'm going to go ahead and write bad weather. And on both of those. So I didn't walk. Um, on Friday, I actually did not hit my hydrate goal by two. So by two little teardrops here. Um, I got seven hours and 30 minutes of sleep. Um, I got my move goal of 911. My KCAL intake was 871. That was that firehouse sub. And my workout on Friday, I got nine minutes of 30 that I was supposed to. On Saturday, I did hit my water goal. Um, I've been having a lot of knee pain. Um, a lot of knee pain to the point where I may need to go visit the doctor. Um, on Saturday, my sleep was seven hours and 55 minutes, which I don't think I really slept seven hours because I was, I have been so, so tired. Um, my move goal on Saturday was 796 and my KCAL intake on Saturday was 773 calories. I ate a Subway sandwich that day and I did not walk because of knee pain. I had an enormous amount of knee pain. One, I, I'm gonna write that in just a second. On Saturday, I got seven minutes of 30 on my workout. And on Saturday, the 27th, it was one month smoke free. That is a huge, huge deal. One month smoke free. Very proud of myself. Yesterday, I did not hit my water intake by a lot. I only did five. Um, and that was just because I got so busy and just engulfed in what I was doing and wasn't drinking like I should have. Um, I slept for seven hours and 10 minutes. Um, my move was 623. My KCAL was 623. Now, all I did yesterday was I drank some coffee in the morning. Um, because 
I I got coffee just in time for me to go to work. And then um, for lunch, I had McDonald's, but I only ate a portion of my sandwich because, to be honest with you, it wasn't very good. Um, and then um, when I got home last night, my knee was in, I'm, I'm struggling with some knee pain. And um, my knee was hurting so bad that I really didn't, wasn't hungry. I just wanted to kind of lay down. So I ate some chips and salsa and that's what I ate for dinner. And so my intake yesterday was terrible, which I'm sure had a lot to do with why I was tired. Um, I Obviously I did not rock yesterday due to knee pain. And then my workout yesterday was seven minutes of 30. Sorry, I took a sip of my coffee there. All in all this week, other than the fact that um, this is very busy, um, I'm not real happy with the way the week went when it comes to workout. Um, my knee pain has really been off the charts, but I am glad that I'm not having any anxiety, um, which is good. So let's hope for a better right, next week. I do know that I actually gained one exact pound, which I don't know how. My work, my weight is kind of at a plateau. I'm just kind of weight. I'm losing a pound, adding a pound, losing a pound, adding a pound. So hopefully with work getting busier um, and I'm going to make some dietary changes this week. I'm hoping things get a little bit better um, when it comes to weight loss. So thank you for joining me for this very long, tiring week um, um, plan with me. And I hope to see you next Monday for my next week long plan with me. Bye.